one of the projects on the Forerunner is to make sure that I can get the radio to be Bluetooth enabled. I don't really ever listen to the radio. I listen to a lot of podcasts and audiobooks and my own selection of jams, but I like to do all that through my phone. This radio is a good radio. It's got a CD player, a tape deck on it, it's got a sweet tape deck on it, and I love the telescoping um, radio antenna. I originally thought I'd search to find a Bluetooth enabled radio, take this radio out and replace it. Then I got to thinking, well, what if I could just get a Bluetooth enabled to the speakers? I don't really need a radio. And then I started doing some research and I thought, well, why not just use a Bluetooth radio receiver with the existing radio? It's less than $20, so I'm going to test it out and see. This one had some great reviews. And then also one of the challenges is just a place to put my phone. In the Subaru, I attach it to the air vents, but the air vents in this are too loose um, and they're just not designed for that. When I took the trip to Columbia, I did mount a GoPro mount there with the phone holder and that only made it about 40 miles before it fell off. And so additionally, I got a dash phone holder, which is a little bigger and more cumbersome, but I think it will help not only with having the phone easily available for navigation and for Bluetooth connectivity, but if I'm in a spot, I think it will also serve as a tripod if I wanna use the phone for filming instead of the GoPro. I think it needs to be a relatively flat space, but the dash isn't quite exactly flat there. So I think I want it just slightly on that angle. And because of the ball adjuster on there, I should be able to level the phone even if the base isn't level. I mean, I guess that's true because you put it on a window and it still would fit okay that way. The instructions describe this disc as semi-permanent, which I think really means permanent. That feels pretty good. Certainly a little higher than I expected it, but I don't know that it can be any lower. All right, now it's time for the Bluetooth setup. Good. That could be a problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, um, when I screw up, though, it's the... So I switched this to flip all the way around so that the push down lever is in the back, peel up is in the front, and hopefully it has less leverage as it's pulling it up there. Then I also saw that this can lower down so that it doesn't sit quite as high, which I think is going to make it much better. That holds up. I think we've got a winner. The Bluetooth works great. Hey Siri, play yeah. This Will Be Our Year by OK Go. Here's This Will Be Our Year Hi-Fi version by OK Go. One of the things I really love about this Bluetooth connector is it shows me what the voltage is on the battery whenever I start up the car. So I can watch to see if the parasitic drain is doing anything. I 
I think this is gonna work. And it was less than $20. And so simple.